same day as my last video and I've probably still got pizza around my mouth because as soon as I stopped the Costco haul I ran straight to the pizza box didn't I? <laughs> I'm absolutely starving but um, I'm not so much now I've had two slices. Dave's just making Lucas some food and I'm aware I look pretty rough today. <laughs> it's been one of them, them sort of days. But I am really pleased because I've managed to get lots of Christmas. Oh, if you knew, hi, my name's Sam. <laughs> I've got loads of kids. <laughs> um, but yeah, I have managed to get um, quite a lot of Christmas presents today. So I'm really chuffed with what Because I've spent what? loads in Costco today, I've not got as much in Asda. But I will go back through the week because I haven't got enough meals to last. I've got chicken burgers from, hang on. Mike! Mikey! I'm doing me all! All I can hear is I'm talking with the norm in here doing me. <laughs> anyway, right. So I've got my chicken burgers, so I'm going to make chicken burger wraps and stuff. And I, there's plenty in there for leftovers, you know, like for kids to make themselves from school and stuff. So I've got those. I've got the sausage um, things, which I'm going to make with chips. And we've also got lots of chicken wings. So it's like three good meals worth to take us into week. So I'm obviously going to need more than that, more shopping, because we keep just running everything down, even though I feel like I do nothing but top up shops because of the packed lunches. All about them, this is mainly what this shop is, but I'll just crack on and I'll show you what I've got. Because if I don't, you're probably all just going to be asleep. But this is what £90 has just bought me in Asda. There is water bottles, they're actually from Costco, but I've just used them to put my stuff on top. But the £90, in fairness, I did spend, because I've got Lucas, uh, so if you knew, I've got a baby, four month old baby. But it's nearly five months now, believe it or not. But he needs a bigger size of these, um, it's getting really cold, these... Um, Tog blankets, he kicked all his blankets off last night. I had to keep waking up like all the time to check on him. He's only next to me, like when next to me things. But obviously I don't want him getting cold. So this was £13.50. Dave, have you seen how cute it is? Yeah, £13.50. Look, it's got little dinosaurs on it and little leaves and Aww. stuff. It looks right autumnal, doesn't it? How cute is that? Got Lucas, his nappies. So they were £6.00. The, oh, I've downloaded a Pampers app so I could scan stuff when I bought Pampers because I think you get like a free pack of nappies or something and I forgot, didn't I? But they only had, um, they didn't have any as his own brand in size 3 so I've had to get him the Pampers but I did buy him these last time and they've been great to be honest with you. So they were £6 on offer for 40 nappies so they'll last us a little while. Um, his baby milk which is over there is also £10.50 so you can see why this shop has come to so much when you've got £10.50, £13.50, £6.00. So like 20 pound there 10 there so that's like 30 pound just on the three baby things anywho i've got some pops so they were on two for three pound cherry aids about 80 pence that lime stuff is from costco as well sorry these hauls were a little bit muddled but i'm just trying to get them filmed for you um i've also got um these which are on two for three pound 50 which my kids love so shane hasn't eaten his tea tonight so i know he'll eat one of these and he'll probably eat all that pack if i let him he's obsessed with crumpets so i've had to buy some more crumpets i don't know why i forgot to get butter though actually um, I don't know why, but he's gone on to crumpets and he's literally having them for breakfast as soon as he gets in from school. We've also got some grapes that run two for two pound. Um, but where's the other bloody box? Dave, have you left? Oh, no. Sorry, Dave. It's okay. It's fine. No. I thought I'd left them in the car because it's like Jenga with all Christmas presents in there and we don't know. You know, quite often I forgot. Oh, I might have forgot some off the all for all I know. But um, the other stuff went middle seat, so it should all be here. Uh, but yeah, we've got two lots of grapes. I'm going to chop them up for packed lunches. And we've got some sugar snack peas because Shane likes to snack on those. And Millie loves the raspberries, so we've got them. Got two lots of corns to go with tomorrow's dinner. I've got quite a bit of veg in the fridge that needs using up carrots and broccoli and cauliflower. So I've got them. Shane's currently sneaking a King de Bueno, like I can't see him. <laughs> um, okay, <laughs> we've got um, sandwich meats for the pat lunch. So we've got, these are on two for 350 So we've got ham. Ham. Oh, I've got honey roast. Oh, the mouse will get eaten. And two chicken. So we've got them for the pat lunch sandwich things. And I've also got cheese because Caitlin likes the cheese. That were on offer in Asda. I think it was £3 for a block of cheese. And I'm meant to get some grated and that. But I know I can grate it myself. It'll just save time. But do not matter. That's absolutely fine. What is it? Are those red fruits cherries or grapes? These ones? These are grapes? Oh. I know. Oh. No, he wanted cherries. Right, I'll get you some neck fruit. Wait, so we've got some Yorkies, some mint penguins. Josh loves mint. We've got mint penguins. We've got some wagon wheels. Mint penguins, look. Mint. You love penguins and you love mint. It's your lucky day. <laughs> He's doing a little giddy dance. 
Um, I thought I'd got three lots of these, but there's only two here. Um, I swear I got three. Might have to really go check that car, but these were a pound, so we've got um, the roasted chicken. And I think I got two of the southern style, even though they prefer those, so I don't know what we're thinking, but I don't know where it is anyway. Um, we've got two lots of yoghurt chains for pat lunches and some toffee crisps. We've got bananas. We've got Ryan's. Um, he really liked these from us, the last ones I got him. So I picked him up some more. I'm sure it would have liked the salted ones. Watch me, we've got completely wrong ones. We've got him them anyway and he has his hot dip. He loves this hot stuff. We've got, for fruit week, if I don't get out shopping, I've got an emergency bag of pasta and some sauce. Pasta bake. Most of them love it. Jodie hates it, but I can... She does some cheese pasties knocking about somewhere in the freezer that I could cook up for her. But yeah, we've got them. These 90p, I think they are, but they all love those little beefy sticks. She peanut butter stuff. So this was £3, um, which, yeah, it's a lot for peanut butter. Millie loves the peanut butter. Um, I would have got as the zone but I forgot because this went end of a different aisle and I thought I'll pick it up so I remember to get peanut butter but I forgot the peanut butter and I ended up buying this so it was three pound but it, I've got peanut butter and you know I'll just have to you know manage but we've got some uni poo pro because I just thought it just kind of jazz up going to the toilet a bit so it went to pound fifty uh, do you like this uni uni poo roll Jacob Oh, isn't it cute? <laughs> to be honest with you, that ain't gonna last two minutes in this house that that four rolls. But price of toilet paper in Asda was just disgraceful. <laughs> but what are they add in tonight? It wasn't all available. A lot of shelves were empty on you know toilet roll aisle. But I want uh, I just couldn't have. So I've got four to last us, and I'll pick some more up tomorrow fruit week or something i've got another little hand there's another hand getting another kinder bar um i did get shane a nice coffee because he does love them we've got banana porridge for baby that's two pound forty and a warburton's roll now don't get me wrong they're one pound forty i think for warburton's and it's half the price to get asda's own bread which i would usually do but i thought it's weekend we'll treat ourselves to some warburton's because it's my favorite bread so i've got that also got a big tube of Pringles and then I got these Chris and you can probably see we've had the bad takeaway tonight because uh, I've been a bit busy. So I have got the big pack of Chris. Now I really like getting these ones. They're £4.95 for 18 bags so they're by no means cheap but all those flavours they all love. There's no flavour in there that they don't like. They all like cheese and onion, ready salted, the sensations and those ones. I mean, not everyone, every kid will like them, but I've got a kid that will like all them flavours, if you get what I mean, so they will get eaten. They won't be like, you know, a bag of prawn cocktail knocking round back at cupboard in a year's time. You know, they'll get they'll get eaten, so that's pretty good. I also got some reduced... Um, go on, you have one if you want one. Um, some reduced bread that was 20p, which I thought would be all right till morning for breakfast when we have bacon, so I've got them. I mean, for me and Dave, kids can... Uh, well, they're not having my warburtons either, so they'll have to see what's knocking round back at the back of cupboard. <laughs> we've got um some pretzels six bags of those there for caitlin because she does love her pretzels and i thought they were a little bit different to giving a crisp so i've got those as well and i think that's about it i don't know if i've missed anything i'm going to get some raisins there millie does like raisins for pack pet lunch stuff so it is like i've got dinners i've got a pet lunch i've got nappies baby food we're all right that way i've already got the because i went to home bargains only the other day so i've got loads of cleaning stuff washing stuff hand wash um, we've got juice, we've got coffee, we've got loads going on. We've got enough to last us a little while now. Obviously, we're a real large family. There we go. All this came to, I think it was £92. I say £92, um, I think it was £92. But yeah, like I say, there's quite a few, obviously there's bits of the baby in there. I'm just, I'm really pleased with what we have picked up today. It's been a really expensive day, don't get me wrong, but obviously Christmas stuff, I set money aside for stuff like that, so when sales come up we can go get stuff which is a really good thing to be doing as well so if you can do that um throughout the year and things and i do the same so i'm building up i'm building up vouchers so somebody asked me have you got the asda rewards yes i do um so i'm building up that i've got the savers thing because the end of end of november you get a bonus on top so you got like a five pound bonus so i've got that and sometimes i do use the, the vouchers as well i think i've only got 21 pound in it so i'd get a would I get a two pound bonus at the minute? But hopefully by then, if I don't use my vouchers and transfer it to the cash pot, it'll build that up. Dave's got about fifty quid in um, Tesco vouchers, which pays for Christmas turkey, and I put away I think I put about twenty pound here and there into a different account for the Christmas food shop as well. I do dip into that sometimes, if I'm being completely honest. But trying to just do what you can to, you know, to, to 
end of day, you know, cr Christmas, although you, you've got this pressure on you to make it perfect, as long as you're all all right and you've got food in your belly or somewhere warm to be, you know, you don't realise how lucky you are sometimes, do you? And I think that's what, you know, not that I've never appreciated what I've got, but... It is, it is true, and it's what these all need to bleed and learn as well. But yeah, this were me all. I hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you soon on the next one. I have no idea what that video will be. I think somebody's just commented, and I'm sorry, I only read it a little bit, so I didn't see who left the comment, but about me doing a men's stocking filler. Um, I think I mentioned it in my video, the stocking filler um, one, that I'd look at men's, a men's £10 stocking filler challenge. So I think I'll do that, but I won't do it in B&M. We'll go to Warm Bargains or we'll go to Poundland or somewhere like that to do the um, the men's one. But I think, I think I've think i had pretty good uh, home bargains for that off the top of my head. I think we could do quite well with a tenner in there for a man. So we'll see what we can do and it'll give me something to do for a week as well, aside from cleaning the shit all. Anyway, <laughs> I'll see you at next one guys. Bye! Oh, if you aren't already, please like and subscribe.